On this episode of Mythbusters, free suffocation. Can you die getting stuck inside a refrigerator? So, mummy, tell us what you know about the, the about climbing into em empty fridges. Supposedly, if you climb into an into, into an empty fridge, a child can get stuck in there and can't get out. And what happens to them? They could suffocate. Right. Yes, I too have uh, heard this myth. This is something that my, my mother used to rabbit bang on about, you know, oh, we've got to be very careful about old fridges. You don't want to have old fridges around because kids have apparently got in there and suffocated and stuff. And uh, I always wonder, why can't they just push the door open? So we've actually got a new fridge. <laughs> and here it is. Hello. And here we've got an experimental subject. We've got, we've got our old fridge out here. Can you, what, are you, what are you about to do, Diana? That's Jasmine. Yes, he's a good horse, and hear how she sounds. A few ant. There's a few ants in here that's concerning the uh, the escape artist. You just got to kill those. Ugh. Okay, there's still a few ants. There's one more ant. Daddy, should I kill it? Yep. Daddy, it's gone. It's gone under. Oh well. Are we ready? Yes. Line your back. No, I can't. Line, line your back so you can push the fridge door open when, it, when it's down, okay? Okay. Ready? Bye bye! I think I'm out of my. Is this going to be okay? Okay, push it open. Yes, there we go. I think yes. See? It's quite easy to push it open, isn't it, Diana? Yes, there we go. So the problem with that experiment was we managed to break the fridge door off. <laughs> oh. Oh well. Did you suffocate? What do you mean suffocate? Are you dead? No. <laughs> Could you can, can you breathe? Yes. Uh-huh. Could you open the door? Yes. Uh-huh. Right. But it broke. So Diane, what do you think about the fridge suffocation myth? Busted. You're fantastic. So what do you think of the fridge suffocation myth? Busted. So, Mummy, what do you think of the fridge suffocation myth? Busted! So, Isabella, what do you think of the fridge suffocation myth? 